Hi guys, I hope you are doing well. Welcome to my channel. In this clip, I want to show you how we can have an edge detector in Unity without using post-processing of uh, default Unity. Okay. Uh, first, we should take a look at this package. This project has been released by Kjero, which is called Kino Counter. Uh, it has been released six years ago, but it is really good and powerful. Uh, you just need to download the zip file from the whole project. I will share the link of uh, this page in the description of this video. After you download this package, uh, you just need to drag and drop the assets folder into your project folder. After that, uh, we should come over here. As you can see, it has either kind of erection standard assets and tests. In the test asset, the test scene, as you can see, we have some uh, objects in the scene. Uh, these two characters and one particle system. Look at this. These particle systems are instantiation here, and now look at the, the the result. If I play the scene, look at this. We have just the camera view. In the main scene view, there is nothing happened in the object look at this in the particles these, these are the particle uh, you know default particles and for avatars there is no changes in the uh, shaders but in the view we have this and let's take a look at the the settings the background color you can change the background and in the line color you can change the line Oh yeah, sorry. And in here we can say tertial, uh, lower bound, for example, it can be here to change the accuracy of, uh, of an edge detection. Look at this. It will be like this. And in here for sensitivity, sensitivity we can change the color. Look at this in here, even it can detect the shadows as well. And in the depths, we can change the depths in here and the normal one. Look at this here, we can say just having this the whole edges. And this is the jitter motion of the camera. Look at this, it's moving here. If I disable it, the camera stays in the edge uh, itself, uh, the position of itself. But in here, you can change the adding a noise action to your camera. It uh, it will be useful for even other scenarios uh, without even the edge detection as well. Okay, I hope this tutorial will be helpful for you. Don't hesitate to ask any question related to Unity, AR, VR, and XR. Subscribe my channel and like this video if you like it. Have a great time. Bye-bye.